After a tumultuous storm here in South Bend last night, we woke up to a lot of displacement in our backyard, mainly baby birds. I didn't notice anything different until I saw my dog Atari staring at this drainage area right by the basement. He just kept looking at it and was so fixated on it. So I knew there must be something wrong. So it looks like a bird was trapped in this area. So my husband grabbed a bucket and gently pushed those baby birds and caught them. And then we decided what course of action to take next. Jordan managed to get the two chicks into a bucket. Without touching them. Without touching them. We're pretty sure their mom and dad are aware that they're there. I've called two animal help control numbers, got voicemail both times, so I'm assuming that there's been a lot of animal displacement due to the storm last night. So uh, let's go take a look and see how they're doing. Okay. I'm assuming that's, <gasps> okay. I think Might we have a whole nest going on in this tree in our neighbor's backyard right now. Okay. Yep. Okay. They both look okay. Yeah. I think Rico just scared one really bad. Okay. Yeah, they're still babies. Aww. That one's a bit of a jerk. Rico found one over here in the grass. All right, we decided after some research online, it's probably best to just let the birds go in a safe space where the dogs can't get them. They look a little bigger, they're fully feathered, so we think they're fledglings. Read online that it's just best to keep them on the ground. Their parents can feed them and care for them and teach them to fly from the ground. Ah! 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 <laughs> I'm gonna catch one, son. We're just really trying to keep them safe so that the dogs don't hurt them. Oh, the other one disappeared, Jordan. Did it get out of the hole? It went in that hole. Just put that one go through that hole, too. The parents will be able to take care of them. Yeah, it looks like it snuck out through that little spot. Okay. Okay, little birdie. First, I thought the bird was gone. It's just very well camouflaged within the leaves right now. Based on a report and infographic from Audubon, the largest nature-based conservation in New England, we learned that if you see a bird's nest, you should return the baby bird to it. Birds don't have a developed sense of smell, so the parent won't know if you touched it. If you can't see the nest, find a container. A small basket or plastic container will do. Line the container with dry grass and secure it to a branch attaching wire to the container. If you're dealing with a fledgling, the best course of action is to leave it be. Get it out of immediate danger, but the parent will most likely find it and teach it how to fly from the ground. It is illegal to raise a baby bird on your own. Those who survive will be at a disadvantage because they missed out on lessons from their parents. Lastly, don't attempt to feed the baby. Parents can do a much better job. Come back to check on With that, I'm Camille Starnes. Thank you so much for watching. If you do enjoy our content, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more. Bye guys.